Let's start with a tweet from Neil deGrasse Tyson stating his skepticism about aliens wanting to visit Earth. Quote, how egocentric of us to think that space aliens who have mastered interstellar travel across the galaxy would give, pardon the French, uh, would give a shit about humans on Earth. So let me ask you, would aliens care about visiting Earth, observing, communicating with humans? Let's take a perspective of aliens, maybe Sarah, uh, first. Are we interesting in the whole spectrum of life in the universe? I'm completely biased, at least as far as I think right now, we're the most interesting thing in the universe. Um, so I would say expect um, based on the intrinsic curiosity that we have and how much I think that's deeply related to the physics of what we are, that other intelligent aliens would want to seek out examples of the phenomena they are to understand themselves better. And I, I think that's kind of a, a natural thing to want to do. And I don't think there's any kind of judgment on it being a lesser being or not. It's like saying you have nothing to learn by talking to a baby. Uh, you have lots to learn probably more than you do talking to somebody that's 90. So um, yeah, so I think they absolutely would. So whatever the phenomena is that is human, there would be an inkling of the same kind of phenomena within alien species and they would be seeking that same. I think there's gotta be some features of us that are universal. And I think the ones that are most interesting, and I hope I live in an interesting universe, are the ones that, are driven by our curiosity and the fact that our intelligence allows us to do things that the universe wouldn't be able to do without things like us existing. We're going to define a lot of terms. One of them is interesting. Yes. Uh, that's, that's a very interesting term to try to define. Uh, Lee, what do, what do you think? Are humans interesting for aliens? What, let's take it from our perspective. We want to go find aliens as a species quite desperately. So if we put the shoe on the other foot, of course we're interesting. But I'm wondering, um, and assuming that we're at the right technological capability to go searching for aliens, then that's interesting. So what I mean is, if there needs to be a massive leap in technology that we don't have, how will aliens prioritize coming to Earth and other places? But I, I do think that they would come and find us because they'd want to find out about our culture, what things are universal. It, what about, I mean, I'm a chemist, so I would say, well, is the chemistry universal, right? Are, are the creatures that we're going to find making all this commotion, are they made of the same stuff? Um, what does their science look like? Um, are they off planet yet? Um, I guess there's, so I, I think that Neil deGrasse Tyson is being slightly pessimistic and maybe trying to play the tune that the universe is vast and it's not worth them coming here. I don't think that, but I just worry that maybe we we don't have the ability to talk to them. We don't have the universal translator. We don't have the right physics. But sure, they should come. We are interesting. I want to know if they exist. It would make it easier if they just came. <laughs> <laughs>